Hey guys, so I promised I would do this about three weeks ago um, when I first got this mascara. It's Lash Blast Length, and mine is not waterproof, and it's by CoverGirl, and it looks like this, and I have the color Very Black. Um, I bought this, like I said, about three weeks ago, and I said I was going to do a review about two weeks ago, but then I didn't. Um, and I'm actually glad I waited to do it because um, my first time trying it, I didn't like it. I wasn't very happy at all. And then I guess over time I learned to love it. It's not that I learned to love it. It's just that I accepted it for what it was. I thought it was going to be like Lash Blast, you know, because like Lash Blast length. So I thought it was going to be like Lash Blast plus length so I thought it was really cool but it's not that's not what it is um it's a lengthening mascara and I figured out that I like volumizing more I have like no eyelashes at all um this eye you can barely see anything I don't have any mascara on it so like I don't even like you can barely see my eyelashes so I thought this was gonna be really cool um so I tried it out and the first time and it didn't blast or volumize it just lengthened and I was disappointed um, so I didn't use it for a while, like a couple weeks at least, and then lately I've been reading so much about it and everyone's like in love with it. Like for example, um, in Marie Claire's October magazine, um, like October 2009, um, like it was a beauty buy by the, let's see, the beauty director Ying Chu, it's all folded up because I fold magazines whenever I want to buy something. Anyways, so Lash Box length is there. And I was like, um, why is it in there? It's not good. I don't like it. And it says, I'm going to quote, I'm going to read it directly from the magazine. It says, like falsies, CoverGirl Lash Blast Length Mascara, $7.49, is made up of nylon fibers, which help create an eye-opening, mile-long effect. And I was like, wait, so you're telling me that, like, this mascara is supposed to make my eyelashes look like I have false eyelashes on? And it was just, like, crazy. It was also in... In Styles November 2009 um, magazine for like beauty buys or like best beauty buys or something. So I tried it. Um, I tried it at first. What I used to do, like when I didn't like it, I would put Lash Blast on and then Lash Blast Length so I could get like both because that's what I wanted. Um, and then I tried this alone again. Um, and I would do it only, it doesn't work with just one layer to me. I have to get like at least two or three layers. And then also, I tried it with like a primer, and I, you know, I just tried it a bunch of different ways, and I love it. <laughs> That's so bad for me to say, because like, I didn't like it at first, but I love it now. Like, I know how to use it, I guess, or I learned how it works best on my eyes. So I'm going to show you guys what it does. Um, I put it on what, this eye, and there's two coats on there. So I'm just going to zoom in and show you what it looks like. So yeah, it's really long, like it works, and that's just with two coats, and you can get it like more dramatic, I'm pretty sure you can go like to three or four coats, that's just with two. So I'm going to show you on the other eye and see like how different, right now look at my eye. There's nothing there, and you don't even feel it, like when I roll my eyes up, I can feel my eyelashes touching like up here, like you can feel it, but on this side I feel nothing. Um, so, I don't know, I like being able to feel it. So I'm just going to do a couple of coats right now. Oh, this is what the wand looks like. This is another reason why I didn't like it at first, because the wand is yellow when, like, you first buy it, and I can still see the yellow. So I was thinking, like, the formula is not good, um, it doesn't even hold on to the wand, so how is it going to hold on to my eyelashes? But I guess this is how it's supposed to be, because in the InStyle magazine, this is what it looks like. I don't know. So, here's what the wand looks like. You guys can even see the yellow. Um, it's bendy. Which is really good because for the first time ever, because this is so tiny and small, I was able to get, like, no, I didn't even do this eye yet, but the very insides, you know what I mean? Like, right there. I've never been able to get those. And in this eye, I got them. Like, you know, I have mascara on them. It just looks so much better. Um, 
Yeah, and it also it doesn't it doesn't clump or anything because I mean if it doesn't clump on the wand, you know it's not going to clump on your eyelashes. So it just separates, you know, it separates them. That's what I'm saying. Like it doesn't clump, it separates. So it separates and lengthens. So you're left with like these long like I want to say spider looking. Like they're so cool. So I'm just going to do this eye really quick. So with just two quick coats, I'm going to zoom in again. See how long it is? Like, really? <laughs> Not, like, now I can feel it on my arches. Like, it just feels so cool. And because the wand is so small, you can get, like, the very insides and you can get the outsides. And you can also do the lower lashes, which obviously I didn't do in this eye. And at first, when I first saw this, I was like, okay, this would be a good thing to wear to um, church or something, you know, where, like, you don't want to wear a lot of makeup or, like, an interview. So even if you have, like, thick eyelashes and you just want a mascara, that'll separate your eyelashes and lengthen them and make them, like, look like you have falsies on, um, this is a really good one. So I absolutely love it. According to the magazine, it was about, like, seven fifty at the store. So I would recommend you go get this because I'm in love. Bye, guys.